I could not be here breathing and be comfortable if I was really as bad as they was making, you know, and nobody could be around me. So for me to be this calm, I must have some kind of inner peace. And my inner peace is knowing that once everybody takes the time to really see what type of person I am, you'd be surprised that I stuck around this long. I have to make the life that I do live as happy as I can and try to do the best with what I have. Do, you know, live the best life I can live, be as happy as I can be. N nothing is perfect for anybody. I don't know. Boys, I swear, I think I figured it out. You know why they don't want us redneck brothers and sisters and the hood brothers and sisters getting along? You know why? Because we'd be unstoppable. I'm telling you right now, we would shut shit down. Thank you very much, Mayor. Excuse me, Trustee. Um, I'm working on just letting you know I'm working on getting the, the chat live again, okay? Just letting you guys know. That's what I'm working on now. Thank you, Ontario. Okay, pulling the warrant list here for uh, I do have one uh question prior to the corporate bills. Uh the previous board meeting, we made a request that the severance package, the severance pay for a certain employee be included on the last warrant list for payment. Uh, from my understanding, that check has not been issued yet, and I would like to ask, is there something that's preventing it, that, that check from being released um, to either Chris or anybody that may be able to give me feedback because we would like that check to be released? Okay, I'll look into it for you. Next. Uh, well, I've sent the email, so we've been looking into it for a month. I would, I would like to ask if somebody couldn't resolve that right now i think it's a simple enough request uh -huh. well no one can resolve it if i don't know about it so now that you're telling me about it i'll definitely get a response to you so question heard next the next thing i'm going to do is we want to there are uh thank you very much mayor this is just the formal vote on a um agreement a, a separation or severance agreement that was discussed in June's board meeting during executive session. So we have to have a formal vote for the agreement and to issue the payment. So I'm asking that we, well, I motion that we approve the agreement uh, discussed in executive session. I'll second. All right. There's a motion in a second. Um, any discussion? Okay, so I guess you wanna to explain to the residents what, what we're doing or what you are proposing. Well, oh, trust you. no. Well, my explanation was it's the severance agreement that we are that we already discussed. Right, we discussed in closed session, but now it's on the floor. You have to tell the people what it is we're doing. So, what are we? If what are we like about to elaborate? Propose? Please feel free, but that was my explanation. Okay. So let me explain something to anybody over here. When you guys put stuff on the agenda, it's y'all agenda item. Y'all have to elaborate to the public, the residents, to tell them why y'all see fit. Why are we pushing this agenda? Uh, you, you guys can't be afraid to tell people what it is you're trying to do. Yes, I can elaborate. I can say what it is you're doing, but it'd be my opinion. So then we go back and forth. So I give you the floor to speak and say, this is why I did it. This is what I think is best for the village. But no one seems to want to tell people why you guys are voting the way you're voting or suggesting what we do. So that's why I'm asking if you could tell the people, because of course I'm, I'm going to say what I'm going to say, but it's your agenda. Uh, well, I explained it's a, it's a severance arrangement. So the floor is yours, Mayor. Okay, so... I guess trustee, I don't want to explain to the people what it is that they're doing. Okay, so we had a meeting, what was it? Uh, June, I would say, first week of June in regards to creating um, a salvage package for an employee that uh, got terminated at the village of Dalton. Um, the employee only been in office, well, worked with the village for five years. So the board sees fit that the person should get um, a payout. My advice as mayor was to not do so, that I don't think we should create uh, things of this cal caliber because once you do this, you're gonna open Pandora's box. Um, half of the time when people do get a payout like this, they've been there for 30 plus years. It's not created for people that's at will or people that think um, the village owes them anything. Everybody that works in politics or have a political position or however you guys wanna phrase it, um, it's at will. When you're at will, you can get fired for any given reason. So I just want people to know that uh, I am not in favor of creating this. Um, I think that this is going to open up Pandora's box when it comes to other employees that have been here, got fired, got terminated, and they feel that they can come and get um, pay a payout because they was terminated. 
So that is my um, synopsis for it. Anybody have anything to say? Any trustees? Sure. Um, may I be recognized? Sure. Um, so in regards uh, to this matter, um, I don't know if we're like, I don't know if this if it's not like the employee or exactly what we're doing. You went in and but out. I, I, okay. Can you hear me, ma'am? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. You went in and out. Go ahead. Okay. Um, in regards to the severance package for the employee, um, this is something that I agreed upon or um, I was in favor of because um, I felt like I, I, and I know you stated it's politics, um, but I just felt like personally, um, the, the worker was, was a good employee. She's been a good employee for us. And due to the, the circumstances, I felt as if um, I'd like to give her a serve severance um, since she no longer works with us. And I didn't feel personally um, as if just not giving her anything, considering the fact that she is she was a uh, buyer. OK, thank you. Anybody else? No one else? OK. So um, everyone said they statement for the record, and um, I will try to make sure that everyone um, stick to transparency as it relates to talking to the public and just state the facts of how you feel instead of just saying um, you guys feel that a person should just get a payout. So with that being said, um, Clerk Key, call her. Trustee Holmes. Excellent. I'm sorry. I didn't hear you, Holmes. You had an echo. Can you repeat your vote? Can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you. Excellent. I got you. Thank you. Trustee Norwood? Aye. Trustee Steve? Aye. Trustee Belcher? Aye. Trustee House? Aye. And Trustee Brown? Aye. Motion passes. Uh, as reflected in the record, the majority of the Board of Trustees, Belcher? Aye. Trustee House? Aye. And Trustee Brown? Aye. Motion passes. All right, thank you. So, um, Mayor's veto message to the Board of Trustees and the residents of Dawson. Uh, August 2nd, 2021 action. Uh, as reflected in the record, the majority of the Board of Trustees voted to approve a service agreement for former Village Administrator Elizabeth Scott. This action is not in the best interest of the village. It creates a liability against the village and it requires the unnecessary spending of the village funds. First, the village administrator was an executive management employee who served at the pleasure of the mayor. In other words, she was an at-will employee. According to the law, an at-will employee can be terminated for any reason or no reason at all. Second, providing a service package to an at-will employee sends a negative message and sets the stage for an, any employee terminated in the future to demand to pay a service that they are not entitled to under the law. This will create a big burden and liability on the village's budget. Therefore, I officially veto this action and will submit my written objections at the next board meeting. Mayor Tiffany. So I'm just letting you guys know that it's coming. I want to read that into record. And that is for the record uh, clerk key. And I will email that to you. Um, next, we have Mayor. I could not be here breathing and be comfortable if I was really as bad as they was making. You know, nobody could be around me. So for me to be this calm, I must have some kind of inner peace. And my inner peace is knowing that once everybody takes the time to really see what type of person I am, you'd be surprised that I stuck around this long. I have to make the life that I do live as happy as I can and try to do the best with what I have. Do, you know, live the best life I can live, be as happy as I can be. N nothing is perfect for anybody. I don't know. What was I swear? I think I figured it out. You know why? They don't want us redneck brothers and sisters and the hood brothers and sisters getting along. You know why? Because we'd be unstoppable. I'm telling you right now, we would shut shit down. Drunk as yeah. Yeah, Imagine if my small business blew up overnight and I woke up to some sales. Boost this video so people who like my products can find me. Algorithm. Where you at, bitch? Cause I'm tired of posting viral content and getting two and a half likes. We finna fight ho. Yeah, oh my no, can't